Capito da chapter 70. Chapter 70, that is company accounts. Company accounts. The subtitle is Issue and Revision of Debentures. In the company account, the subtitle is Issue and Revision of Debentures. Before going to know the method of how the company issue its debentures and how it relieves its debentures, it is necessary for us to know the meaning of some words. Meaning of some words. Therefore, we shall start it with introduction. Introduction. Company account. Company. This is the third form of business organization. This is the third form of organization. You have already studied in previous first year that the one is a sole trader. Sole trader. Second one is a partnership. And this is the third one. This is the third form of business organization that is company account. First one is a sole trader. Second one is partnership firm. Now coming to the third one, this company. Therefore, this account is called, this form of organization is called the third form of the organization. Now coming to the introduction. When the size of the business expands, when the size of the business expands, it shall not be possible for a single trader to meet all the business requirements. To meet all the business requirements. Therefore, he joins, he joins this organization that is company, company organization. Therefore, he joins this organization. It is not possible, it is not possible for a single person to meet all the business requirements when the business grows, when the business grows. Therefore, he joins this organization that is company. Now, coming to the meaning of company. What is meant by company? A joint stock company is nothing but it is a voluntary association of persons. It is a voluntary association of persons formed to carry on business with a view to earn profit. With a view to earn profit. That is our company in a general sense. In a general sense, company means it is a voluntary association of many persons, of various or many persons. Many person to conduct the business and with a view to with a view to earn profit. No, yellow puro, Ibrava Murmanikata Haji Puro, business and a start of another, yellow tagging, profit and a girl's name for Mutashika, last month of the Katala, profit and a girl's name from the Yella Karina Madra, Alka and Katari, company, you do general sense. General sense. Now coming to that definition, what is meant by company? Lord Justice Lindley has defined a company as it is a voluntary association of many persons who contribute money, who contribute money or money's worth to a common stock, to a common stock and trading the business or business is carried on, sharing the profits and losses therefrom. This is the definition given by Justice that is Lord Lindley. He said that what is meant by company? Company means it is a voluntary association of persons. It is a voluntary association of persons who contribute money, who pay, who pays money or money is worth. Money or money is worth. Money or money is worth to a common stock. To a common stock do the business and sharing the profits and losses sharing the profits and losses that is called company as per justice lately this is meaning and definition now coming to the features of a company what are the main features what are the main features of a company what are the main features the main features of joint stock company are as under number one company is an association of persons company means to call it as company to call it as company there must be many persons there must be many persons one the company now the organization the company has to carry it for the all the part of the way to Ibrahim Ibrahim Murman is the company all you know it's here you know it's here general sake all the way to all the company has to carry it for the company is an association of persons this is first character second 
with a view to earn profit with a view to earn profit what is the main objective of this company the main objective of this business organization is to earn profit this is second characteristic earn profit last one ko dekha chal pura gel re yaar ella uddeshya profit man ko dekha tha mundal last one aaye aaj modale mukhya uddeshya hai na wo profit this is second characteristic now coming to the third characteristic it is compulsorily registered under the company's act under the company's act this is the third one to call it as company to call the business organization as company it must be registered it is compulsorily it is compulsorily registered under the company's act no the company at the very end that the company registered le era out of the registration of the incorporation of the ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಡಿ ಸಿ ಆಫೀಸ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ರೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಹೋಗಿ ರಿಜಿಸ್ಟ್ರೇಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿಸ್ಬೇಕು ಅವಾಗ ಏನಾಗ್ತದೆ ಕಂಪನಿ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಜಾರಿಗೆ ಬರ್ತದೆ ಅಥವಾ ಕಂಪನಿ ಅಂತ ಅನಿಸಿ ಬರ್ತದೆ ರಿಜಿಸ್ಟ್ರೇಷನ್ ಆಗಲಾರದೆ ಅದು ಕಂಪನಿ ಆಗುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ರಿಜಿಸ್ಟ್ರೇಷನ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಂಪಲ್ಸರಿ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಒನ್ ನಾವು ಕಂಪ್ಯೂಟರ್ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಒನ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಪೆಕ್ಚುವಲ್ ಸಕ್ಸೆಷನ್ ಪರ್ಪೆಕ್ಚುವಲ್ ಸಕ್ಸೆಷನ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಪೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಡೆತ್ ಆರ್ ಇನ್ಸಾಲ್ವೆನ್ಸಿ ಆಫ್ ಎನಿ ಮೆಂಬರ್ ನೋಡಿ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಪೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಡೆತ್ ಯಾರಾದರೂ ತೀರ್ಕೊಂಡ್ರ ಯಾರಾದರೂ ಮೆಂಬರ್ ತೀರ್ಕೊಂಡ್ರ ಅಥವಾ ಇನ್ಸಾಲ್ವೆಂಟ್ ಆದ್ರೂ ಕಂಪನಿ ಎಂದು ನಿಲ್ಲುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ಕಂಪನಿ ಎಂದು ನಿಲ್ಲುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಹಂಗ ಮುಂದುವರಿತದ ಕಂಪನಿ ಪರ್ಪೆಕ್ಚುವಲ್ ಸಂಶ್ಲೇಷಣ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಆಪರೇಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಆಪರೇಟ್ ಆಪರೇಟ್ ಆಪರೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಪೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ ಸ್ಪೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಡೆತ್ ಆರ್ ಇನ್ಸಾಲ್ವೆನ್ಸಿ ಇನ್ಸಾಲ್ವೆನ್ಸಿ ಆಫ್ ಎನಿ ಮೆಂಬರ್ ಯಾರ ದಿವಾಳಿಗೆ ಯಾರ ತೀರ್ಪಳಿ ಬೇಕಾದಾಗಲಿ ಕಂಪನಿ ಎಂದು ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ಆಗುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ನಿಲ್ಲುವುದಿಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಹಾಗ ಮುಂದುವರಿತದೆ ಇದು ನಾಲ್ಕನೇ ಇನ್ನು ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಒನ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಲೀಗಲ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಲೀಗಲ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಇದೇನಂದ್ರೆ ಲೀಗಲ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಇದ್ದಾಗ ಇದು ಕೂಡ ಇದು ಕೂಡ ಕಂಪ್ನಿಯು ಕೂಡ ಒಂದು ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಇದ್ದಂತೆ ಬಟ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಲೀಗಲ್ created by legal therefore it is a legal person it is an artificial person it is an artificial person krutak krutak manushya iddaga but it act acts through its directors its directors so it is an artificial person company means it is an artificial person ee manushya iddaga manushya yaar kodo thagomodu ella maatara kharidi maatara sale maatara kodtana rakka kodtana rakka isuvatana ಯಾವ ರೀತಿ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಮಾಡ್ತಾನೆ ಅವೆಲ್ಲ ಕೆಲಸಗಳನ್ನ ಕಂಪನಿನೂ ಮಾಡ್ತದ ಆದ್ರೆ ಆನ್ ಬೇಸಿಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎನ್ ಆರ್ಟಿಫಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಏನಂತ ಕರಿತಾರೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಆರ್ಟಿಫಿಷಿಯಲ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿತಾರ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಅವ ಎಲ್ಲ ಕೆಲಸಗಳನ್ನ ಮಾಡ್ತಾನ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಂಪನಿ ನೋಡಿ ಈ ಎಲ್ಲ ಕೆಲಸಗಳನ್ನ ಯಾರಿಂದ ಮಾಡಿಸೋದು ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಅವರಿಂದ ಮಾಡಿಸೋದು ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಂಪನಿ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ characteristic next characteristic is the liability of members is limited to the extent of face value of the shares held by them the the liability the liability of the members is limited the liability of the members is limited to the face value of the shares held by them avu yen shares anna padidirthara adara mukha belege avara liability irthara ಅವರ ಜವಾಬ್ದಾರಿ ಎಲ್ಲಿವರೆಗೆ ಇರ್ತದೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿವರೆಗೆ ಅಂತ ಹೆಚ್ ಕಿ ಇಲ್ಲ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ದ ಲಯಾಲಿಟಿ ಆಫ್ ದ ಮೆಂಬರ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಯೂಶಲಿ ಲಿಮಿಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರಿಸ್ಟಿಕ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ದ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕಂಪನಿ ಆರ್ ಫ್ರೀಲಿ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್‌ಫರೇಬಲ್ ಬೈ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಮೆಂಬರ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೋ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರೈವೇಟ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರೈವೇಟ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಬಟ್ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಪಬ್ಲಿಕ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ದ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಫ್ರೀಲಿ ಎಕ್ಸ್‌ಚೇಂಜ್ ಶೇರ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ನಾವು ಒಬ್ಬರಿಂದ ಒಬ್ಬರಿಗೆ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಚೇಂಜ್ ಮಾಡಬಹುದು ಎಲ್ಲೇ ಪಬ್ಲಿಕ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಒಳಗೆ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೊ ಆದ್ರೆ ಸಾಧ್ಯ ಇಲ್ಲ ಎಲ್ಲೇ ಪ್ರೈವೇಟ್ ಕಂಪನಿ ಒಳಗೆ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ
after a complete. These are all the main features or characteristics of a company. There must be more persons than the loyalty of the persons uh, limited to the face value of share shareholder. Every company must uh, have its uh, common sale. Like this, these are these are all the features, main features or characteristics of a company. Now coming to the next one, share capital of a company. Share capital of a company. Structure of share capital of a company. Before going to understand the structure of the share capital, it is necessary for us to know the meaning of share capital. To know the meaning of the share capital. What is meant by share capital? Share capital means share capital means the capital raised by the company by issue of its shares. That is called share capital. Share capital means share capital means the capital raised by the company. The capital raised by the company by issue of its shares. Shares are not the same as the amount of 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 the to the public, to the public, that is called share capital. Then, how the structure of share capital? The structure of share capital is as under the structure of share capital of a company is as under. Number one, authorized capital, first authorized capital, registered capital or nominal capital. Authorized capital. No, not only the capital, but authorized capital. And the most necessary registered capital. Then nominal capital, more necessary. Authorized capital, registered capital, nominal capital. All the three are same. Now, coming to the first, what is meant by authorized capital? Authorized capital is authorized capital is the maximum amount of capital. Maximum amount of capital. Which a company is authorized to raise from the public by issue of shares. By issue of shares. That is called authorized capital. What is by authorized capital? Authorized capital is the maximum amount of capital. Authorized capital is the maximum amount of capital which a company is authorized to raise, to raise from the public by issue of its shares. That is called authorized capital. That is authorized capital. First one is authorized capital. Now coming to the second one, issued capital. Issued capital. What is meant by issued capital? Issued capital is nothing but it is the part of the authorized capital. No, authorized capital is not other part. It is the part of the authorized capital which is issued to the public, which is issued to the public for subscription. That is called issue capital. Sarvajanikar ke yeh ni issue maan tere. Adha yeh maan issue capital. Sarvajanikar ke yeh ni issue maan adho. Adha issue capital. Then, coming to the next one, third, subscribe capital. Subscribe capital adho. Subscribe capital means, it is the part of the issue capital. Not, it is a part. Athraya part is issue. Issue is a part of subscribe. It is the part of the issued capital which is actually subscribed by the public. Which is actually subscribed by the public. That is called subscribed capital. Subscribed capital is called Khaidishan Bandawala. Subscribed. New year of the 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 year but not subscribe capital. Therefore, subscribe capital is nothing but it is the part of the issued capital which is actually subscribed. Which is actually subscribed. Subscribe means purchased. Purchased. Which is actually purchased by the public. New you can bring it up. What do you want to bring it up? Subscribe. You have to bring it up. That is subscribe capital. Sarvajanikar, Yatana Kiri Matala, Akana Yatana, subscribe capital. Now coming to the next one, 
card of capital. What is meant by card of capital? Card of capital means it is the part of the subscribed capital. No, it is the part of the subscribed capital which is called up by the company. Which is called up by the company. New year call for the world. Alkana in the world. Called up capital. Then paid up capital. What is meant by paid up capital? It is the part of called up capital. It is the part of a called up capital which is actually paid by the shareholders. Which is actually paid. By the shareholders, that is called paid up capital. Like this, the capital structure is like this. The capital structure is like this. Number one, authorized capital, then issued capital, subscribed capital, called up capital, paid up capital. In this manner, the capital structure is like this. This is share capital. Now, coming to the meaning of share. Meaning of share. What is meant by share? Share on the Share on the end. What is meant by share? Share is nothing but a, share is nothing but a, it is a share in the share capital of the company. This is a definition given by the Companies Act of 1956. As per, as per Indian Companies Act of 1956, what is meant by share? Share is nothing but a, it is a share in the share capital of the company. It is a share in the share capital, in the share of the share capital of the company. Company has share capital of the company. Other 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 each part or each unit is called a share. Not capital and that is company capital and that. Anyka bhaga na ke mano. Anyka bhaga na ke maari. Aap vandu vandu bhaga. Adhna share rata. Vandu vandu bhaga ya rata. Adhna share rata. The second definition is like this. What is meant by share? Share means if the total capital of the company is divided into many parts. Each part or each unit is called not a company a capital on a new visitor on a universal. We can see very very part of my model. Our part of my other share of capital. Therefore, share is nothing but it is a share in the share capital of the company. This is one definition. Now, coming to the second definition, when the total capital of the company is divided into many parts or units, each unit or each part is called share. Pratyondu Bhagavata, Pratyondu Yudhukana, Share and Petra. This is the meaning of a share. Now coming to the next one, types of shares. Types of shares are kinds of shares. How many types in shares? Share one of the economy with another. How many types are there? There are mainly two types. The company can issue only two types of shares. What are those? Those are preferred shares and equity shares. Preferred shares and equity shares. Equity shares are also called as ordinary shares. Equity shares we know as another ordinary shares. Other than the other company, shares are the other one of the company. In India, every company issues only two types of shares. Preferred shares and equity shares. Now coming to the meaning of preferred shares. What is meant by preference shares? Preference only one to provide. Preference only first preference should be given to this person. Second person should be given to this person. Each of them are given. Preference only Mahatwa. Preference only means precious share Mahatwa. Preference. Other it is you. Preference shares. Preference shares only means preference shares only. Hanamana Marwe Purwaga. You are given only precious to number one. Nantala you are given only. Therefore, preferred shares are nothing but they are the shares. Preferred shares are nothing but they are the shares which have preferential right, which have preferential right at the time of winding up of the company, at the time of returning their amount to the shareholders, or at the time of distribution of dividend to the shareholders. First preference will be given, will be given to these shares. 
therefore they are called preference shares adrenaline avu yen ketrandra preference share holders preference shares antu ketrandra preference share holders antu ketrandra yakandre first preference avarige modale preference avu avarige amount anna hali kodavaga dividend anna hanchuvaga ena maduvaga company olaga ena karya maduvaga first preference avattu ivarige kodtara adrinda ivarige hindantara preference share holders are preference shares therefore preference shares are nothing but they are the shares which have preferential right which have preferential right over the kinds of other shares over the kinds of other shares in respect of dividend or in respect of repayment of capital repayment of capital in the event of liquidation of company in the event of liquidation of company while closing the company if any amount is payable as dividend or return the amount such preference will be given to these persons therefore these persons are called preference shareholders or preference shares this is the meaning of a preference shares now coming to that next one the holders the holders of these shares get a fixed rate of dividend or preference shareholders ya matlab fixed rate of dividend is there the holders of these shares are called preference shareholders and they will get fixed rate of dividend fixed rate of dividend even in case of a loss in the company not company olaga loss iddrunu saitha neevu maatadara prakara avage dividend kodalai beku yara avage loss agidre dividend kodala antu kelodalo dividend kodalai beku loss or loss maartu anda hinga antu loss yav maartu anda neevu adakke neevu loss aagale profit aagale nam sambandha illa nam maatadara prakara fixed rate of dividend kodalai beku yara antare preferential owners therefore preference share owners will get fixed rate of dividend fixed rate of dividend nimu profit aadrunu avaru ashta amount kodbeku loss aadrunu saitha avaru ashta fixed rate of dividend kodbeku idu enandre preference shares now come to the next one equity shares second type equity shares after knowing the meaning of preference shares now we shall proceed to discuss about the equity shares what is meant by equity shares according to the companies act of 1956 1956 equity shares are nothing but they are the shares which are not preference shares which are not preference shares yavu preference shares alla ava equity shares ram andre yaru ram andre yaru yaru lakshana alla avana ram ada type illu ada type illu yen andre equity share andre andre equity share andre yavu preference share alla ava equity share therefore equity shares are nothing but they are the shares which are not preference shares which are not preference shares this is the definition given by the indian companies act no real personal id equity share andre no one more second now you have to remember equity share andre yav preference share alla ava equity share andre marudu andre sir you one mark to the ye madre samskara mark so yav preference share alla ava equity share ये हमारे बैंक रहे थे। ये नॉट एक्चुअल मीनिंग है। What is the actual meaning of equity share? Equity shares do not have preferential rights. Do not have preferential rights over the payment of the amount or dividend. The rate of dividend on equity shares is not fixed. Is not a fixed. The rate of dividend is not fixed. It varies from year to year depending upon the amount of profit in the company in the company not company of profit to make depend your dividend yarige equity shareholders ge equity shareholders dividend is purely depend on the profits of the company profits of the company this is equity shareholders now equity shareholders are the real owners of the company one important line is who are the real owners preference shareholders are not the real owners they are not the real owners or real owners alla anga real owners yaar andre equity shareholders equity shareholders are the real owners of the company company and nijavada malikaru andre ivaru yaar equity shareholders company and nijavada malikaru ivaru equity shareholders preference shareholders alla this is the types of this is about the types of shares then 
is you are chefs, is you are the chefs, method of is you in chefs, how the company is you, it says the company can issue its shares in the following manner. First, the company should issue prospectus. For example, the company is the company the prospectus and issue the public. The newly company, the newly started business companies issue prospectus to the public. What do you think about the company? The prospectus is the public. Then, in the return, they should get a Minimum subscription, minimum subscription. After that, application for shares, allotment of shares, and calls made on the shares. Calls made. After allotting the shares, after allotting the shares, the receiving and receiving the allotment money, the directors of the company can call up the balance amount in various installments. That is called call. That is called as call. First call, second call, third call, and final call, like this. Therefore, call is nothing but an offer made by the company to the public to pay the balance amount. That is called call. Therefore, what is meant by call? Call means offer made by the company, offer or request made by the company to the public to pay the balance amount. To pay the balance amount is called call. First call, first offer is called first call, second offer is called second call, third is called third call, and the final offer is called final call. This is about the method of issuing its shares. Tomorrow we shall discuss the next things. Yes. Thank you.